So over here, you can see that I got three objects in my Figma design file. So if you want to select out all of these objects, you can click and drag around and then all of the objects are selected. You can click outside and the object is deselected right here. So if I want to select out, let's say two of these objects, I can hold shift on my keyboard, click on this, uh, on the rectangular file right here, click on the uh, oval right here, and both of these are selected while this is deselected as you can see. If you want to select all of the objects, you can also alternatively go to the main menu and then over here on the edit menu, you can see select all is an option. So once you do that, all of the frame is actually selected, including the frame, everything, the shape, the frame, everything is selected right here. So let me just go around and select both of these objects right here and go around over here on to the menu. If I were to go around into edit, you can click on select none and then it'll be deselected as you can see. You can also select this out, go around into the menu, and then you can go around into edit. And here you can see select inverse is an option. The shortcut key for this is control, shift, and A. So if you were to click on this, everything that is not selected will now be selected as you can see. In my case, the square was selected, so now these two are selected. So if I were to go around over here onto the menu, and if I were to go to edit and click on select inverse, now this will be selected as you can see. And that is how you can use the select all, select none, and select inverse option inside of Figma design file. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.